The Occupational Safety and Health Administration, or OSHA, requires the use of engineering controls to eliminate or minimize exposure to bloodborne pathogens. Vanish Point syringes meet OSHA's criteria for an engineered Sharps injury prevention device. The healthcare environment is busier than ever. Vanish Point syringes allow you to give injections safely, efficiently, and easily. Vanish Point has a full line of automated retraction syringes, one milliliter, insulin, tuberculin, and allergy, three milliliter, five milliliter, and 10 milliliter with a wide variety of needle lengths and gauges available to meet your injection needs. Vanish Point syringes are color coded for needle gauge using international standards for needle gauge color codes. All Vanish Point syringes have an attached triple beveled needle for patient comfort and safety. Vanish Point's closed system design prevents potential medication contamination and leakage. The unique hubless design reduces the amount of dead space or medication left in the syringe after the injection is complete. Vanish Point syringes have less dead space than lure fitting needle and syringe combinations. The Centers for Disease Control has stated that needle changing is unnecessary. Vanish Point syringes are applicable for most injections and are easy to use. Draw up medication as you normally would. You may inject air into a vial if necessary. Measure the medication dose using the leading edge of the black plunger seal. The retraction mechanism on top of the plunger seal will not interfere with measurement and has been accounted for in the calibrations. When injecting, fully depress the plunger to give the complete dose and activate the retraction mechanism. Using your thumb to depress the plunger and positioning your fingers under the flanges will allow you to easily squeeze through the slight resistance point. In one easy step, the needle is automatically retracted directly from the patient, preventing exposure to the contaminated needle and virtually eliminating the risk of a needle stick injury. Once activated, the retracted needle can be seen inside the barrel of the syringe. Medications can be reconstituted and administered using the same vanish point syringe. Once the correct amount of diluent has been measured, remove the needle from the vial of the diluent and add a small amount of air. This air cushion will allow all of the diluent to be expelled from the syringe without activating the retraction mechanism. Mix the reconstituted medication according to the manufacturer's instructions. The reconstituted medication can then be drawn up and administered. An alternate activation method is to grip the barrel of the syringe with your fingers and depress the plunger with your thumb. If aspiration is indicated, it can be easily done using either technique. Once the safety mechanism is activated, the needle will automatically retract directly from the patient into the barrel of the syringe. Most needle stick injuries occur within seconds after the needle is removed from a patient. Activating the retraction mechanism while the needle is still in the patient virtually eliminates the risk of a needle stick injury. The Vanish Point syringe's built-in spring is sufficient to withdraw the needle from most injection sites. However, if an injection site is unusually dense, the retraction may be slowed. When injecting into pierceable IV ports, the gentle spring action of the Vanish Point syringe cannot withdraw the needle. For injections into pierceable IV ports, simply remove the needle from the port as soon as the plunger has been fully depressed. The needle will then automatically retract. Vanish Point syringes are ideal for intradermal injections, such as TB skin testing. The integrated safety design has no added on components to get in the way. This allows vanish point syringes to achieve the low angle of insertion necessary for intradermal injections. Just as with subcutaneous or intramuscular injections, fully depress the plunger using your thumb to squeeze through the slight resistance point to activate the automated retraction while the needle is still in the patient. The needle will automatically retract and is safe for disposal. Dispose of Vanish Point syringes in a Sharps container in accordance with your facility's protocol. Activated Vanish Point syringes require less disposal space than most other syringes and eliminate disposal-related injuries. 
The complete line of Vanish Point syringes allows you to safely give intradermal, subcutaneous, or intramuscular injections. Vanish Point. Safe for you and your patients. The Occupational Safety and Health Administration, or OSHA, requires the use of engineering controls to eliminate or minimize exposure to bloodborne pathogens. Vanish Point blood collection tube holders meet OSHA's criteria for engineered Sharps injury prevention devices. The healthcare environment is busier than ever. Vanish Point tube holders allow you to draw blood safely, efficiently, and easily. Vanish Point tube holders are designed for use with conventional multi-sample blood collection needles up to one and a half inches long. They are not for use with winged needle sets or lure adapters. Vanish Point tube holders are easy to use. Securely thread the blood collection needle onto the tube holder. Perform the venipuncture following your facility's protocol. Insert the appropriate blood collection tube, advancing the tube to initiate blood collection. Repeat with additional tubes as necessary. As the last tube is filling, remove the tourniquet and place gauze at the venipuncture site. When filled, remove the last tube. While the needle is still in the patient, close the end cap. Vanish Point allows you to keep both hands safely behind the needle while activating the retraction mechanism. The needle will automatically retract directly from the patient into the tube holder, protecting you from both ends of the blood-filled needle. By placing your fingers behind the tube holder flanges and your thumb on the end cap, the end cap can be quickly and easily closed. Vanish Point tube holders completely enclose the contaminated needle and prevent needle removal, which is prohibited by OSHA. When using small diameter blood collection tubes, you should use the Vanish Point tube adapter. Begin by inserting the tube into the adapter. Then, insert the adapter into the tube holder. Repeat if necessary. When the last tube has been filled, remove the adapter and close the end cap. Dispose of the Vanish Point tube holder in a Sharps container in accordance with your facility's protocol. Vanish Point tube holders are single use. Vanish Point tube holders allow for safe and efficient blood collection. Vanish Point. Safe for you and your patients.